This boating season has shaped up to be especially dangerous for North Alabama. There have been at least five water related deaths in just the last two months. As more people head out to the water for the July 4th holiday, water rescue squads are gearing up. Way 31 Sierra Phillips went out on the water with the Gunnersville Rescue Squad. She learned what they are doing to keep boaters safe. All the drope traffic and everything, people running sea doos and everything, it's just hard to sit there and ride the waves and try to catch something, you know. Cody Hamilton says he plans to avoid fishing on Lake Gunnersville if traffic gets too heavy this Independence Day. We'll get wild before? Yes. <laughs> from what I've seen, yes. The Gunnersville Rescue Squad will set up around where fireworks will be launched to make sure people don't get too close. They'll also be ready if accidents happen and have volunteers on standby. It's just a number of people that aren't experienced to be on the water, and then if you add alcohol to the mix, it only impairs them further. And crews are concerned people might decide to head out on the water without wearing a life vest. As a gentleman from the Coast Guard said the other day, life jackets float, you don't. Rescuers say they have three tips if you're headed out boating tomorrow. Make sure your cell phone is charged. Make sure you have a designated driver if you're going to drink. And always wear your life vest. Reporting in Gunnersville, Sierra Phillips, Wave 31 News.